Ever since I was six years old, I've been fascinated with doing voices. And then I actually got into doing voiceover. I've been doing it for 27 years. And then I started a school. It's called On The Mic Training. Mike and I developed the full-time diploma program. Our whole purpose of doing that is to create voiceover artists who have an authentic voice and prepare them for the market that demands exactly that. Oh, the program is absolutely fantastic. It's setting you up for everything in terms of the business, in terms of audio engineering, in terms of performance. You know, you understand exactly the tone and genres of the different things. You understand what your wheelhouse is, and they set you up with demos at the end. Like, you got everything that you need in order to really establish yourself into this business. I think one of the great things about On The Mic is that it feels like a professional working situation. This is the first time I've ever seen a school that is concentrated solely on voiceover. The whole experience was an absolute joy. I absolutely love dubbing. I'm not even an anime person. Definitely video games. I'm a huge nerd in video games. I really enjoyed the improv stuff. Before attending this program, I would do my auditions and it would come to a point where I'm like, I don't love it. I don't know why I don't love it. I need someone to tell me what it is that I'm lacking. And it was that very first video games class that I really felt myself break through. Well, I had no idea what to expect. Um, I just went in it wanting to have some fun and possibly having a career change. And uh, I took the foundations course with uh, Michael Dobson and that was awesome. It changed my whole world in a sense of, I knew at that point that I wanted to pursue voiceover. I feel like all of our teachers really brought out this sense of joy and life and they really brought the best out of every one of us. You have a staff of working professionals. You bring the current conversation directly into class. We got to learn like what kind of tools are being used, what um, programs are being used for mixing, and even just basic mixing, which could kind of put us ahead. It doesn't matter, you know, what level you are. When we work with you, we're working with you specifically at what your goals are and what you want to accomplish. When I came to OTM, I was so nervous about everything but the environment itself was so welcoming and warming that it made me feel really comfortable. And I felt that I could say anything, I could do anything, I could try anything. I feel when students leave OTM, having been in the full-time program, they are ready to dive in and give it their all to work in this field. If the program is too intimidating, like you can always take one of the part-time courses just to kind of dip your toe in and see, but I think most of the people that do take the part-time courses, they love it and they're interested in the full-time program. Generally with the full-time program, when they come in and they're so fresh and maybe a little nervous and shy, where I try and instill as a teacher is the foundation of support and trust. At the beginning of the program, you said that it was going to be life-changing and we would come out the other side of it totally different. But you're totally right. Like anything, you're gonna grow and it might not be easy the whole time, but when you achieve what you went out to do and you went through all of the obstacles to get there, it's very rewarding. So I want you to know all of the different things to take control of your own career and your own life. That whatever it is is calling you inside is possible. You never know where you're gonna end up. And your dreams can only be accomplished by walking towards them.